Since the transitioning to a new defense and picking things up this summer? Uh, it's been good. Um, we got a lot of good players here. A lot of, a lot of dynamic players here. We can take the game over themselves on the field. Um, Coach Bench, you know, making us in turn, like, confident in how more just how we play. Stamina, you know, fighting through a lot of adversity. Um, it was a hard camp for a lot of us. And it built us, built a lot of calluses. And, how did, you, how did you decide to, to transfer and then any schools did you look at? How did you find your way here, the whole process? Um, somewhere to start history at. Somewhere that was already history at. Um, I've seen what they got going. Uh, there's a lot of things that ASU that um, you know, I just wanted to start somewhere new and do somewhere you know, it was different. And, um, I think that was about it. Just trying to go somewhere to uh, start somewhere new. Now the coaches have said you pretty quickly digested the defense. How do you feel just generally about the scheme and, and where you're at with that? It's good. I feel confident. Um, a lot of people on the team asking me different stuff. Uh, Defensive-wise, um, I'm not trying to mark myself as a leader. Uh, you know, leaders are crowned by their teammates and different people. So I'm um, just trying my best to help with the defense and uh, help the team in general. In your recruiting process, what was like the vision that was pitched to you about what role you could fill in this defense? Uh, be just a dynamic playmaker, smarter. Um, last year I was playing off a, a lot of instinct, but you know I was also taught a lot about the game in general. So just picking up where I left off last year and trying to build on different stuff, um, but more mentally, uh, making sure I got the right things going. You're tall and you're still side linebackers. How did that become position? Uh, just from being confident, honestly, there was a lot of uh, things that I was taught at ASU from, you know, Antonio Pierce and different people. And yeah, um, I'm just happy to, you know, be here with that. I'm, I'm confident in playing where I'm picker. I'm confident in how I play. And, um, you know, I'm not really letting outside and everybody say different things about me. I'm just worried about what I can do, what I can control myself. And, um, that's really what I got. Why, why did you want that spot? Why was it the spot that you thought was best for you? Um, that's where they want me at. If they want me at rush, I play rush. If they wanted me at corner, I play corner. Wherever, wherever Coach Bench and my defensive coordinator and my coach wants, coaches want me to play at, that's what I play at. So, this inside linebacker, that's what I got doing now. Is there anything that you feel like your size allows you to do at linebacker that maybe other people can't? Uh, see over the line, um, going to different pass lanes, uh, disrupt uh, a lot of passes, um, get off blocks easily. And, um, Try to be mentally uh, understanding that, like, it's not only about you know my length and everything and the speed, just bringing physicality. And a lot of people were shocked by you know how physical I am with different stuff. So, I'm trying to bring that every day. What's it been like fitting in with, with Shane and Raylan and, and some of those guys in that group? Oh, it's been amazing. The linebacker group, the group is tight, the team is tight, uh, but we one of the tightest groups. You know, we go out all the time and have fun all the time. So, it's a lot of off the field stuff that we build in, um, but. I, like I said, it's amazing being with them. Like once, like I said uh, at the beginning, we got a lot of players that can put the game into their own hands. Raylan and Shane are one of those people that could put the game into their own hands for sure. Um, just like a lot of other people, like uh, Rajon, um, just for linebackers, Rajon, uh, CV, um, with different linebackers, like uh, you know that we're just trying to build off of and um, learn off each other. It's a lot of things that we don't. We don't 100% know the playbook. We don't. Nobody's going to 100% know everything about the playbook. So, uh, trying to learn as much as we can. Let's do one more. Coach Odom said you play with a chip on your shoulder. Where does that come from? Uh, just trying to get better every day. Um, not feeling like I'm proven. Uh, not feeling like I'm respected. Not feeling like the team is respected or the defense. Um, so, like I said, I'm not really worried about the outside. I'm just worried about myself. And, um, I'm really just trying to get the team the best as they could be. And, um, so, I got to play with a chip on my shoulder to do that. Thank you. Thanks, sir.